This is a 2006 Shearwater 2200Z center console used for bay and flat fishing. This one is decked out with everything you need. It's an excellent design. It's got a black hull, a custom T-top, and it comes with a Shearwater trailer in very good condition. Some disc brakes. It's powered by a Yamaha VMAX HPDI. 225 horsepower. No problems with it. It's got a flat jack jack plate, Lenko trim tabs, a power pole. It's got an extra seat here for the stern. And underneath, there's a live well. Just gonna go around the boat. It's got a Minn Kota Riptide trolling motor. It's 80 pounds and has a quick release. You can see the hulls in very good condition and this boat has tons of storage there's also four rod holders on each side of the console here there's a speaker for the stereo and the rod holders you stick the rods in there and then there's flaps in the t-top where the rod hold, where the rod can actually poke through the uh, the canvas there. It has really good access. Here you can easily change your oil. And here's all the bilge pumps. Really easy to change the filters instead of having to crawl around. You can just reach in there. Got a C-Star ram. And there are three live wells. All three of them have fills. And the one in the front has a macerator aerator. So it has pop-up seats. There's another live well. With the fill. can be used as storage or as a fish box. So these seats are foldable. You can fold them down. And you can use those leaning posts. There's the console. And it's got tack digital gauges. One for speed and one for trim. There's the uh, lift plate for the jack plate and the trim tab and here's all your switches for the light and live well wash down there's your throttle got a nice raymarine unit the A60 it has GPS sonar fish finding you got cup holders for your beer and a uh, windshield here to keep you dry. T-top's in really good shape. Got a rocket launcher. And there's the seat in front of the console. And underneath. Is a live well, which is the one with the macerator, and it also has a fill. And on each side here, 
is rod storage. You can fit six in each side. And there's actually 20 vertical rod holders throughout the boat. This is your fish box. up here. Here's the Minn Kota Riptide trolling motor. Quick release. That should be your anchor storage. And this one is also Rod storage for six. Or you could just use it as storage. Both are very clean. Ready to go. No problems with the engine. And then here we have a battery charger, three bank, and the batteries themselves are down here. We've got three of them. And it's got an eight person capacity. And it does have stereo, you have dual speakers, and the deck fits in right here. The boat is good to go.